It's a few years ago, I was working on the village, uh, in the village where the rice farmers are planting the rice. I have seen the pregnant woman struggling with planting the rice. So that case, it's making me to think what can I help those rice farmers? Because according to that pregnant woman, she was struggling for planting. It's so very hard to bend their bones. And can you imagine talking on that swamps? It has caused waterborne disease. So that thing make me to think what thing can I help those pregnant women. My project is solar rice planting machine. It means that this machine you can use electrical energy or you can use solar energy. It depends the where the rice farmers is located. This machine has the ability to use solar energy and even to use electrical or electricity. And if it's not only that, it's, it means that this machine is a friendly considering climate change. Already we have a working prototype and we are still developing to advance more technologies because we are planning to add artificial intelligence and the robotic in order to make these rice farmers to use this machine at small cost and work uh, easily and at a short time. Where you can plant, we have a target where you can planting like 10 hectares per day using one, one strategy or one machine. As I observe in the next five years, we want to modernize this rice plantation method where to planting using hands will become a history in Kenya, Uganda, Rwanda, Tanzania, in all East Africa. Africa.